hello you are welcome how to solve for x in this nice exponential equation here we can rewrite what is given here from the law of indices a raised to power m minus n same thing as a raised to power m over a raised to power n that is here we have 3 raised to power x over 3 square now equals to x from here then we can separate this as 3 raised to power x times 1 over 3 square and 3 square is 3 times 3 which is 9 now equals to x from here then let's multiply both sides by 3 raised to power minus x we have 3 raised to power x times 3 raised to power minus x then times 1 over 9 here yeah. Then equals to here we have x times 3 raised to the power minus x. Then next step from here, also from the law of indices, we can add this power. Then we have 3 raised to the power x minus x times here we have 1 over 9. Now equals to here we have x times 3 raised to the power minus x. Then here, yeah, this is 0 here, yeah, so 3 raised to the power 0 times 1 over 9, now equals to, here yeah, we have x times 3 raised to the power minus x. Then 3 raised to the power 0 here yeah, is 1, so we have 1 times 1 over 9, we still have 1 over 9, now equals to, here, yeah, let's write this again. And change 3 from when we have exponent ln a is same thing as a. So therefore we can write 3 as exponent ln 3 and we have x times exponent ln 3 then raised to power minus x on this side. Then we have 1 over 9 now equals to x times exponent here minus x can come back here from low logarithm and we have minus x ln 3 from here if you are enjoying this class give it thumbs up and also subscribe for more videos thank you now from here we want to apply the lambda w function that is when we have w of alpha exponent alpha the same thing as alpha from here now the power and the coefficient of the exponent are the same now to make this coefficient look like this power we need to multiply both sides here by minus ln3 that is here we multiply this side by minus ln3 and this become minus 1 over 9 ln3 here now equals to here we have minus x ln3 now then multiply by exponent minus x ln3 then here when we introduce the w function on both sides here we have w function on this side and also w function on this side as well so this side we still have w into minus 1 over 9 ln 3 then this side will have reduced to minus x ln 3 from here then minus 1 over 9 here we can write that as minus 3 over 27 that's equivalent fraction then this become w into minus 3 over 27 ln 3 now on this side equals to minus x ln 3 don't forget to give thumbs up and subscribe it means a lot thank you now here we can also write this as w into 1 over 27 then times minus 3 ln 3 we can write this like this which is equals to minus x ln3 on this side and what we have here 
minus 3 here will reverse it up here from law of logarithm then 1 over 27 as well we can write it as 1 over 3 raised to power 3 which can also be written as 3 raised to power minus 3 so here we have w into 3 raised to power minus 3 then ln 3 raised to power minus 3 from here then equals to minus x ln 3 that is from what we have now we can write 3 here as exponent ln 3 so same thing as 3 then we can rearrange this as w into here we have ln 3 raised to power minus 3 left first here then we have exponent ln 3 also raised to power minus 3 which is now equals to here we already have minus x ln 3 on this side then also when we compare this with what we have from w function we have w alpha exponent alpha the same thing as alpha from here then here this power and the coefficient here are similar so this becomes ln 3 raised to power minus 3 now equals to minus x ln 3 and here from the law of logarithm minus 3 can come here and we have minus 3 ln 3 now equals to minus x ln 3 now from here we divide through by ln 3 and ln 3 we cancel out we have minus 3 now equals to minus x then <coughs> multiply through by minus so we have 3 equals to x which imply x equals to 3 and therefore on this problem we have x equals to 3 as the solution thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more exciting videos and turn on the notification bell share this video give it a thumbs up and put your comments in the comment section see you next class and bye for now